Hello guys. In problem E, which is problem of fees, I understand that some of you sometimes you don't know that your broker has some fees. It, they are not hidden. Now, because they are uh, published in, in the website in the fees, okay? You go to the website, you go to the fees, you find these fees, but you you forgot about them. Okay? Now, you should make sure your broker does not charge you for inactivity fee. What does it mean? This uh, here, inactivity fee, it means, for example, each month you don't do a lot of trades or you don't trade at all. You find that your broker charge you $10 or $20 or $50 or whatever is the fee for each month. And you, you don't know. And you stay with this broker one year, two years, five years, six years, and he's taking your money without knowing. Or the streaming data fee. Now, what do we mean by streaming data fee? You know, for the bid and the ask, most of the brokers, they give it for free. It means when, let's say you want to buy a, a Facebook, you should see the bid and the ask, okay? And this price is streaming uh, data for free it means you, you just see the the right price on your uh, for your eyes okay you you don't have a 20 minutes delay so this is without money but some brokers they charge you for giving you this okay so try to see for these two fees inactivity fee and streaming fee which which are very very important now, <clears throat> um, I say here the broker will punish you by having a fee that you should pay each month. For the streaming fee, some brokers ask for money if you want to have live bid and ask streaming data. Okay, and normally you should have them without paying, but some, some brokers, you know, they want to take some money from you with one way or another. If you uh, have this broker he will take money because he has the account and he will take money you can't stop him from taking you uh, taking this uh, money because uh, you agree on the terms that he has be careful most of the brokers don't charge these two fees stated before now uh, the broker that I am with he doesn't charge for an activity fee or a streaming data fee but others do so check with your broker Another fee which is related to news and market uh, market uh, feeds data. Now these, I don't understand why uh, some traders, they buy news that are free. News, you go to any, uh, to any website that have news and it's for free. So why you should pay for something that it is free? Okay, some, some, uh, Brokers they charge they charge ten dollars sometimes fifteen or twenty or twenty five depending on the broker, and uh, uh, the the free uh, information he brings from Yahoo and from Nasdaq or the company and he put it in his we website, and you you are paying for that. Okay, this is like I'm not saying stupid things, uh, but uh, try to uh, understand that. This news and market feed that are free, and you can get them for free. And all this news are free, and some brokers offers this news for free. And since my strategies are based on price, we don't need the news to trade. It means in in general, I don't use news to trade, because when the news comes and you see them, the price has already taken the news. Understand that sometimes in less than few seconds when the when the news comes and the price has changed because of this news so you until you open your account and see the news it's all over okay you come you come always late and you will never get them on time okay because just few seconds just you want to see what's this until and we have you have a, a mini um, mini stocks you can't you can't do that okay thank you very much for watching see the other uh problem